What's the difference between Office 2024 and Microsoft 365? Now, let's start with the basics. First up, cost and payment structure. Office 2024 is a one-time purchase. You pay once and you're set. This can be a good option if you prefer to avoid ongoing costs. On the other hand, Microsoft 365 operates on a subscription model. So prices are going to be different if you decide to go for the personal or the family subscription. However, because you're a paid subscription, this means you'll always have access to the latest updates and features as long as you keep your subscription active. Next, let's talk about the apps included. Office 2024 includes the core apps, Word, Excel, PowerPoint, and OneNote. If you want Outlook, you'll need Office Home and Business 2024. This suite is designed for those who need the essentials for basic productivity tasks. Microsoft 365, however, offers a wider range of apps and services. Apart from the premium versions of Word, Excel, PowerPoint, and OneNote, it also includes the premium version of ClipChamp, as well as Outlook, Teams, OneDrive, and many more. These additional apps and services can significantly enhance productivity, especially in a collaborative environment. Cloud storage and collaboration is another key difference. Microsoft 365 comes with 1 TB of OneDrive storage per user, allowing you to store and share your files seamlessly across devices. This is perfect for those who work on multiple devices or need to collaborate with others. In contrast, Office 2024 doesn't include any cloud storage, so you'll need to rely on other services. If cloud storage and collaboration are important to you, Microsoft 365 definitely has the upper hand. So which one would you choose? If you prefer a one-time purchase and don't need the latest features or cloud services, Office 2024 might be the way to go. But if you want regular updates, access to a wider range of apps, and cloud storage, Microsoft 365 is definitely the better choice.